here's a question which I received um, from a doctor, an email which I received. I have known you, Dr. Dehans, for many years, and like thousands of doctors, I highly respect your opinion. Thank you very much for that. It's very kind of you. I have a large integrated medical center, and I'm considering adding weight loss to my clinic. What is your recommendation? Adding weight loss to your medical clinic is a good thing. I'm not sure exactly what services you're rendering. I'm not sure. But it's definitely a good thing. It's something that you could do because you can. There are different kinds of weight loss programs, right? There is the medical weight loss program, and then there's the non-medical weight loss program. And by the medical weight loss program, I mean the one that may require either an injection or some medication, things like this. And the non-medical is the more natural aspect. You have to understand that medical weight loss programs or weight loss programs throughout the country are worth billions of dollars, literally billions. They generate billions of dollars in revenue across the country. And there are huge programs out there, huge. From the ones on the internet, to the ones that the doctors provide, from the ones that friends and uh, acquaintances share with each other. And fortunately, it's sad to say, that almost half of our country in the United States is overweight. It's sad, it's sad to say. So sad to say that, as a matter of fact, even some of the commercials that you see today in the journals or the magazines feature larger people so as to give equal time, equal share of the market, knowing and understanding that not everyone is thin and slim. It's an interesting concept. It's an interesting concept that advertisers have realized we need to cater not just to the tall, thin model figure, but also to the heavier people. And so you see in a lot of these advertising, a lot of these marketed uh, brochures and, and, and magazines, you see pictures of heavier people. And some of them are quite heavy. You never used to see this years ago. But today it's part of the norms. And I'm sure I'd venture to say that in your clinic, doctor, many of your patients, perhaps not as many as one out of two, I believe, if I recall correctly, some of the statistics that I read, almost, it's close to 50% of our nation in the United States are overweight. Not obese, but overweight. Close to 50%. That's a huge number. I'm not sure if this number is accurate, but if I recall correctly, I think that this is uh, something which, uh, which I, I, I did read. And if, and if it's not 50%, by the way, it's really close to that. It's a, it's a number which is quite close. So think about that for a second. What should we do? Because it is a, such a high demand for the need to care, if you're considering adding a service, weight loss is definitely a great one to use. It's something which I would highly recommend. I hope this answered your question, and I appreciate your support. Feel free to contact me if you have any more questions. And I'd like to know, if you do this, please let me know either on one of the comments below uh, or share with, you, for me, with me some of the information so that I may take it and share it with everybody else. I will respond to every comment that I receive on this channel. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. Please subscribe to my YouTube channel and click the notification bell to get my latest update.